extensively fortified from the 17th to 19th centuries, the site represents the largest bulwark dry ditch system in the world. Within its walls, the town contains barracks and other military buildings, as well as churches and monasteries. While Elvis contains remains dating back to the 10th century ad, its fortification began when Portugal regained independence in 1640. The fortifications designed by Dutch Jesuit Padre Cosmander, represent the best surviving example of the Dutch school of fortifications anywhere. The site also contains the Amarira Aqueduct, built to enable the stronghold to withstand lengthy sieges. As the remains of an enormous war fortress, Elvis is exceptional as a military landscape, with visual and functional relationships between its fortifications, representing developments in military architecture and technology, drawn from Dutch, Italian, French, and English military theory and practice. Elvis is an outstanding demonstration of Portugal's desire for land and autonomy, and the universal aspirations of European nation-states in the 16th to 17th centuries.